Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we'll learn about the sparse matrix and how we can convert that sparse matrix into a triplet. Sparse matrix is an important concept for machine learning, especially when you will work on the natural language processing, you will learn about the bag of words, you will deal with the sparse matrix. And sparse matrix is a matrix where, first of all, I'm assuming that you have some idea about the matrix. Matrix is basically where your representation in a row and column so basically, I'll just quickly show. Let's start actually the demo. Okay, quickly. So what is the first question is, what is the sparse matrix? One second. Okay. Let me keep the mouse. Okay. So sparse matrix, what is sparse matrix? Sparse matrix is basically a matrix where you have so many zeros compared to your actual value. So let's just write down a sparse matrix, probably random, I'm just putting some random number. Okay, so this is your sparse matrix. And what is this? This is basically four by six matrix. That means I have 24, yeah, four by six dimensions, okay? And let's just put the, uh, probably one second, the index position zero, one, two, three, four, and five, index position zero, one, two, three, okay? So this is my sparse matrix where I have, lot of zeros but the actual values are only present into these places so let me just quickly change my just highlight this so these are the values so only four elements are actually present here but we are dealing with such a big matrix so that's the sparse matrix so there should be a way to convert into a different way and today we will talk about the triplet Triplet is basically converting this sparse matrix into a matrix where we are dealing mainly row, column, and the value. Okay. So how many rows are here? How many rows? We have only four rows. How many columns are there? Six columns. And how many values? We have only four values. And then zeroth row. Let's just write down the zeroth row. What is the column or index position? We have actually on the second index position. And what is the value? One. One index position from the row point of view. What is the column? It's actually on one. What is the value? Its value is the two. Two is basically again the index position one, value is the five. And third is index position is actually fourth index position. Uh, no, I think it's on third index position, sorry. The third index positions and the value is also three. So this is the way we represent the triplet. And why we are doing this thing? Because when we'll actually work on NLP, natural language processing, and especially we'll work on the bag of words, bag of words and those kind of things, we will deal with the big, big sparse matrix. And there should be a way to convert into a smaller matrix. Otherwise, your computation time will be big. You unnecessarily will spend a lot of computation power and all those things. So this is the representation how you can convert a sparse matrix into a triplet. Hopefully, you understand this concept and it's a very important concept. So please um, understand this. Thank you for listening these things. Give me support. Give me thumbs up and give try to uh, subscribe my channel. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Blaze day. See you in the next video. Bye, everyone.